Hello guys, what's up? My name is Israel and I am back with another video. This time I'm gonna be showing you San Miguel de Allende. You probably heard of San Miguel before, it's one of the most popular destinations in Mexico and it's one of the most beautiful and magical towns in my country. I've been to San Miguel quite a few times but I feel like every year it's getting better and better. There's so many new places now. The last time I was here it was like 5 years ago and I feel like it completely changed. Alright guys, so let's get started, let's explore San Miguel together. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you very much for watching. Alright guys, so I just arrived to San Miguel de Allende and I've been working for a few minutes and I can already see a lot of new places. There's so many new galleries and I'm going to show you guys exactly why I love this city. San Miguel is known for having very unique and interesting art galleries, souvenir shops and clothing stores and there's a lot of creativity in general. One of the reasons why I love San Miguel is because the weather is very nice, it's very mild, very similar to Mexico City and also I really love the energy and the atmosphere, it just feels very laid back. So if you are into arts, you're gonna love San Miguel, it's an amazing place for that. And I suggest you come here for at least two days so you have enough time to explore and see all the amazing things this city has to offer. This is La Parroquia de San Miguel Arcángel. It was built in 1909 by Seferino Gutierrez and it is the tallest building in San Miguel de Allende. So I thought this was a cathedral, but it's actually a church and I feel like it's the symbol of San Miguel de Allende. Anyone will know San Miguel when they see a picture of this beautiful church with its pink wedding cake towers. You don't need to rent a car or use any public transportation really, everything you want to see is within walking distance, the city is pretty small and you can just wander around walking and you'll be amazed by all the beautiful architecture of the city and also there's very good restaurants here and street food so you'll probably go home with some few extra kilos. <laughs> Alright guys, so I am walking in a street called Aldama Street, which is in my opinion the most beautiful street in San Miguel. Look at this street, oh my god, I just, I don't know, I really really love it. At the beginning of the 20th century, the town was in danger of becoming a ghost town after an influenza pandemic. But gradually, the city was discovered by foreign artists that moved here and settled, and this gave the city a good reputation in the art scene. And since then, a lot of foreigners, people who want to retire, and a lot of tourists come here to experience the magic of San Miguel de Allende. In 2008, San Miguel de Allende became a World Heritage Site by the UNESCO and in 2017, the city became the world's best small city according to the Condé Nast Traveler Reader's Choice Awards. So every time I visit a new city, I like to go to a rooftop or somewhere where I can see the city in all its glory and I feel like the best place to see San Miguel de Allende is this bar right here which is called Luna Tapas Bar 
which is located at the Rosewood. I feel like this is such an amazing view. I really like the atmosphere of the place and their cocktails are very nice. So definitely consider this place if you like views. So another good place to visit while you are here, it's a market also known as Mercado and here you will find, you know, Mexican candies, souvenirs, flowers, fruits, all kinds of goodies and it's usually very, very cheap. So I strongly recommend that you go to a Mercado. This one right here is called Mercado Ignacio Ramirez and I liked it. I feel like going to a Mercado gives you a feeling of the local people, the local food and it's great to support family business, so yeah, make sure you come. All right guys, we are finished. I feel like we covered enough places and I know this video was a little bit longer than usual, but San Miguel is so beautiful that I was just filming and taking pictures of everything. Um, I mean, there is a reason why San Miguel is so popular amongst uh, Mexicans and international tourists as well. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you guys on my next video. Take care and stay healthy. Oh, 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 oh,